Hello, my name is Zach, and I like to backpack around the world. I've got a good one for y'all today. I am in my hometown of Memphis, Tennessee, and I am here with a fan favorite of the channel, Kim. Yep. Yep. It's great to see you. <laughs> great to see you again. I haven't seen you in a while. Right. <laughs> okay. You have no idea how many positive comments I get about you really? on my channel. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Probably as many as Diana. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. And she does really solid work. I know when I walk out this door, I'm going to look more handsome than when I came in. Indeed, indeed. <laughs> All right, I'm in need of a haircut and a beard trim, so I'm going to let her take care of me. All righty. Now, since I moved over here, uh, my cuts do come with the shampoo. Okay. So... I'm going to drape you up first. I don't mind that at all. Mm -hmm. Do you have anything in mind? How you want your hair cut? Not what? really. Not really. <laughs> Do your thing. Your hair has gone real long. On top, yeah. Yeah, on the top, yeah. <laughs> okay. It hasn't really grown much since I got it colored. Mm -hmm. Do you like the black on there? I like it, yeah. Mm -hmm. You come on over here. I'm going to pull this metal bar back right here and just lay it back. Right. Are you comfortable? Sort of. Right. There you go. You're comfortable now. <laughs> that okay? That's fine. All right. You know, most men they complain about the water being too hot. But... Are you done traveling for the year? Yes, I am. Well, I'm going to Nashville today. Mm -hmm. That's about it. How long will you be there? A day. Okay. For a concert. Who's performing? A country singer, Megan Maroney. I've never heard of her. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure she's doing it. <laughs> You listen to a lot of country or? Not really, no. Okay. Do you? Mm -mm. <laughs> you know, I've listened to like a couple country songs before, but I couldn't tell you who, who sung it. So did you choose the color black for your hair? Aline recommended the purple and then it didn't really look good with my natural hair color, so okay. we went with black. Okay, what's good on you? 
Me personally, I don't like black on me. I get too bored with the color. I'm more so of a, a blonde. That's my go-to color. Looks good. Thank you. This, right, what I have in my head now is uh, ginger. Ginger? Yep, I was trying something different. Put some fish in there. How does it feel? Amazing. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I saw it on Amazon. I was like, I gotta, I gotta try this out. I've never tried it on myself, but. You should. Yeah, man. <laughs> It's like, I'm kind of addicted to Amazon. Like, I don't know why. Beats going to a store. Yeah, that, and then I guess like the prime shipping, it doesn't make that it too. any better, so yeah. <laughs> quite often, don't you? I do, yeah. Mm -hmm. They tend to get the most concerts around. around Clearly. <laughs> I'd rather go somewhere else, but... Mm -hmm. This parking there is expensive. Do you like the city there as a whole, or...? Not really. Not really? Okay. So you could see yourself living there? Oh, no. Okay. Some company, I think, bought up all the lots and turned them into like parking. Mm -hmm. And they charge an outrageous price for it. Okay, you can go ahead. Oh, sorry. For the concert tonight, it's probably gonna be like thirty dollars to park. Great. Is that all night though? Or? Yeah. Okay. And this is Kim's new spot? Yes, new and permanent spot. <laughs> I think since I've started coming to see you, you've been at three different spots? Yeah. So the last week, that was always temporary. And then this is the permanent one. So I know people probably think, why is she moving so much? <laughs> Was the one on Summer, the first one that I yeah. saw you at? Was mm -hmm. that your first spot? First spot, yeah. So you went there straight after school? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Like, I like the shop setting, but um, the extra services I offer, I feel like it wasn't fit for a shop. I feel you. Better off in sweet. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and start on the top first. Have you ever had a, a, a taper before? I probably have. Probably have. Just like a little fade, like right up in the end. I think so. Okay. Are you okay with that? That's fine. Okay. Much here you go. 
I see you've been doing some traveling yourself. Yeah, I went to um, DC back in October for actually for a haircutting class. Did you go with your kids? No, I went by myself. Okay. Solo trip. It was cool, but like, would I travel again by myself? Probably not. You like traveling alone? I do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's me. Oh, okay. I think it's the ESPN <laughs> app. You watch sports? A little bit. Okay. When I'm betting on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you win it all? No, never. Mm. <laughs> but that's the goal, too. Yeah. Man. <laughs> The Kansas City Chiefs let me down on Sunday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was hoping Taylor Swift paid off the referees. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. No, wait, wait, hold up. That's football, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Shut it down. I don't know. I don't know much about sports. That's okay. <laughs> Are you still into anime? Yeah, I am, I am. Um, I just recently watched Attack on Titan, the last, the final episode, and it was it was bittersweet. I still haven't even started on that. I was just about to ask you, <laughs> have you started on any anime? No. no. Okay. <laughs> I don't think I've even turned on Netflix. 
Is it Netflix? Is that what it is on? Uh, yeah. I watched mine on Crunchyroll. Never heard of it. Are you talking about anime, right? Yeah. Yeah. Crunchyroll. Um, Do your kids like it too? Yeah, my son. Well, he's not. He's only watching uh, Dragon Ball Z Super. That's about the only anime. Oh, and One Punch Man. I forgot about that one. So. But yeah, I think One Punch Man, Attack on Titan. I would recommend Naruto, but I think you gotta start from like actually Naruto and then progress to Shippuden. But I like Shippuden better than Naruto. But yeah, sorry, I don't want to get no hair on me. Oh, you're you're fine. <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> so is there anywhere in the beginning of the year that you're going like? I was gonna do Barbados, but I, sh I changed it to Guatemala. Okay. Because the flight was half the price. Mm -hmm. And a place to stay is really half the price. Third of the price. You said third? Yeah. <laughs> About how much? If I wanted to really save some money, I can find a place for $9 a night in Guatemala. Nine. Depends if I want to stay in a hostel or not. That don't even sound real. Yes, but when she did the line design in my mm -hmm. hair, she did a fade as well. Okay. But she didn't. She didn't cut anything off the top. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. Do you prefer the black over your natural hair color? Kind of. Mm -hmm. But I don't want to damage my hair either. So. Yeah. <laughs> he hasn't really grown that much since. I see, with, especially with like the design right there. Yeah. yeah. Do you bleach your hair to get the coloring in there? Uh, you know, I don't know. <laughs> I let my hairstyles do it. Uh, okay. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
So where do you see yourself in five years? Me? Mm-hmm. Probably Mexico. Mexico? Okay. <laughs> like, I living don't, there? I don't. Um, I wouldn't mind. Okay. I don't even know where I see myself next week. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully making a living off these videos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hear that. So you said this spot is permanent? Yeah. For now. Yeah. For now. Yeah. At least at least two, three years, for sure. But <laughs> unless God tells me otherwise. <laughs> Did you get your beer colored? Did I did. Okay. We tried to color it sapphire, but it didn't work out. Okay. Are you ready for Christmas? Yeah, I'm ready for it to be over. <laughs> so around the corner. Yeah, I mostly got my Christmas shopping out the way though. I was productive this year. Amazon? A little bit, a little bit <laughs> off Amazon, yeah. You know any Christmas shopping? Not yet. Not Maybe today. Maybe on my way to Nashville. Mm -hmm. Or in Nashville. You know my thing? Um, Black Friday? Friday Monday? Nope. I usually don't take advantage of those deals. I don't know why.
this location is probably way closer to your house, right? About the same. About the same? Okay. Yeah. I live near Bartlett High. Okay. Did you go to school there? Mm -mm. No. Craigmont? Yes. No. Okay. Probably a good thing you did. <laughs> Why is that? Save you some money. Oh, yeah. Probably could have made more money, though. <laughs> if I went. Yeah. Student loans ain't no joke. Where did you go to school at for, for this? Out by Barber College. That's on uh, Highland? Mm -mm. No? Um, on Thomas, right off Chelsea, North Memphis. Okay. Growing up, what was like your your dream career? I was really into WWE when I was a kid. So, <laughs> like, who was it? <laughs> you want to be like a professional wrestler? Yeah. Okay. to be a, a veterinarian. I love animals. But I realized I've always hated school, mm -hmm. so yeah, that didn't work out. Is that something you would still want to do? Uh, yeah, if I could skip the school part. <laughs> Foster home, like just buy like a bunch of land and open up a foster home for animals or rescuing animals, something to that extent. Now you got a you got a cat and a dog, right? I have four cats. Okay. So the more the merrier, huh? Yes. <laughs> I wish I had someone to film for me so they can get the back. <laughs> Someday.
Are you off of work today? I am. How's that been lately? Busy. Busy. <laughs> so this whole complex is called. What, what's it called? Phoenix. Phoenix. Phoenix Salon Suites. Uh huh. Then does your does your shop have a specific name? Yeah, last option cut. <laughs> my business name. And why did you choose this name? Well, back then it was actually like it started out as a joke. Uh, I mean, I was everybody's last option. And then uh, one day a scripture came to mind um, from Matthew chapter twenty verse sixteen. Uh, Jesus was talking in a parable, and the verse uh, stated, The last shall be first, and the first shall be last. For many are called, but few are chosen. So I said, hmm, okay. That kind of kind of goes along with my story, so I, I'm going to keep it. And regardless of the name, um, my work, my quality of service, it's going to speak for itself. So. It always does. Thank you, thank you. I keep coming back. Go to the gym at all? No. No. I need to. I need to stay consistent. Like I start off, I do good for about a month, and then I just stop. I think at this point I probably need like an accountability partner. You look fine, but I got it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love Dr. Peppers, and they're starting to catch up with me. So. Do you have one in there? I believe so. <laughs> I do got some sodas in there. I love sodas. But I've just been drinking water mainly. Is that your same refrigerator from the other shop? Mm -hmm. Yeah.
Do you like in your car? I do. Okay. Sorry. Right. Good. Good gas mileage. Somewhat. <laughs> What do you have? A uh, Hyundai. Sonata? Uh-huh. Okay. Not as the good most, as... A... The most wanted car yeah. <laughs> out there. And I get real good gas. Um, it's a hybrid, but it's not a plug-in hybrid. Did you see yourself switching to like a electric car or like a Tesla? Yeah, I could. gonna be a minute <laughs> when it black just grows all out hopefully by the time I go to Guatemala Design is gone, so <laughs> making some progress. Tickles. Oh no. Oh, okay.
realize you recorded around the same time last year? I think so. Yep. <laughs> That was our last video. So how long does it take to like edit these videos? Not long at all. Mm -hmm. Not the haircut videos. Mm -hmm. Not the haircut videos. No. Mm -hmm. I usually just upload them as is. That's fine. All right. Do you have a drink I could have? Yes. Yeah, for sure. I know what you like, you like Coke now. I do. Yep. <laughs> do you have one? I think so. I haven't I haven't looked in a minute, so you want it now? If I can. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Oh, okay. There you go. All right. Today's your lucky day. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're Thank you. Cheers from Memphis, Tennessee. <laughs> Are you addicted to Cokes or? Yeah, I okay. am. Can I put it down so mm -hmm. right here is good? Yeah, it's fine. Sorry.
always told you the mirror never lies, so. What is this? Volumizing powder. You got a busy day after you leave here. Just a three-hour drive. Oh yeah, to Nashville. About Nashville, yeah. <laughs>
Do you have more appointments for today? Mm-hmm. Yeah. But you know, time goes back quick to me. Already... Yeah, we've already been here for an hour. Yeah. <laughs> Wave up like this? Not really. Unless we brought it. You got that purple to look more vibrant. Yeah. Is that it? Yep. Oh. Are you finished? I mean, do you want the... Oh, sure. All right. <laughs> there you go. All right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Well, that's going to do it for this haircut beard trim video with the lovely Kim. If you live in Memphis or you're traveling to Memphis and you want to get something done by her, I'm sure she would be more than happy to accommodate you. <laughs> like I said, whenever I get something done from Kim, I walk out that door more handsome than when I walked in. And for this session, that's a thousand percent the case. Look what she did to me. She got me looking right for Megan Maroney tonight in Nashville. So like I said, if you ever want to get something done from Kim, you either live in Memphis or you're going to be in town, highly recommend stopping by and seeing her. Although I think she only does appointments only for the most part, but either way, I'll leave her contact information in the description or right here. Check her out. Highly recommended. I don't think there's much else to say. And she is located at Phoenix. Salon Suites right off Stage Road in Bartlett, Tennessee. I don't really say Bartlett because most people, unless you're from Memphis or you've been to Memphis or you know somebody in Memphis, you probably have no idea what Bartlett is. So Memphis is a lot easier to navigate. 